Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Destiny from Destrix. Welcome back to yet another video in the blog series using Django and React.js. In this one, we'll get started working with bookmarking posts using React.js. That is what we'll be doing. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and learned something new. So let's get started. Begin by opening up your code editor. The function is going to look very similar to this one. But don't worry, I'm not going to copy and paste just for the sake of those that actually want to follow along and type along with me. So I'm going to call handle bookmark. I'm going to create handle bookmark post. You already know the drill. This should be an async function. And the next thing is constructing a JSON object that will be sent to the back end. It firstly needs a user ID so that it will be able to identify what user is saving posts and to know the account that it should assign the saved post to. For now, we'll just pass in one statically. We'll fix this later. And also post underscore ID should be posts dot ID. Good. With all this out of the way, let's go ahead and make a post request to the API that should bookmark a post. So response should be equal to await API instance dot post. Then we're going to say post bookmark dash post. That is the endpoint. Please do not forget to pass in the JSON, which should communicate all the information that the backend will be needing. And after this, you can now go ahead and log response.data. Good. And also fetch posts. Good. So now you can take the handle bookmark post and look for the button that handles the bookmarks, which is this one here. And just say on click of this button, pass in the handle bookmark post. So what do you think is going to happen when we click on this? I want to check my, my console to see post bookmarked, post on bookmarked. So if you want to show a message, should be similar to this one. So now when you click this, see, post bookmarked. When you click again, post on bookmarked. Perfect. If there is something that you guys don't understand, if there's something you want us to do, if there's something you want us to implement, then please let me know in the, in the comment section below and I'll be more than happy to help you out. Consider checking out nestblog.app. You'll get more better components that you could use to style your blog you get comment sections, you get reply sections, you get profile cards, you get blog, and a lot of things. You get cool header, you get cool footer using nextblog.app components. So just check out nextblog.app. You'll be able to build websites faster. You streamline your development experience and you build projects way more quicker than you usually used to do. That is it. I hope to see you in the next video. Once then, mad love. Peace out.